Hey guys, it's Dan, your host of Dan's Reviews, and today I'm back for another video for Stranger Things. And in today's video, we're going to be discussing the main villain of Season 4 of Stranger Things, the extraordinary villain so far at least, and that is Vecna, and what will be his next victim. Just going to be doing another video for today. This one's going to be doing another video for Stranger Things. And in today's video, we're going to be doing a discussion topic video talking about what we think will be Vecna's next victim. So, wanted to wait a little bit uh, to do this video, obviously, because I did the review for this season. I did the review for uh, Volume 1 of Season 4 Stranger Things, which I guess before we move any further in this video, I will advise you, we will be spoiling all events from Volume 1 of uh, Season 4 Stranger Things. So, if you have not watched all of that, definitely definitely um let me know um you know what you're thinking about it so far however maybe do it in the review because we're going to be definitely uh spoiling some stuff in this video which hence is now we're going to jump into spoilers now hence is why i didn't call this video um what will happen to nancy because i don't want to spoil it for people but that's essentially what this video is is will nancy be vecna's next victim is that what they're setting up here at the end of episode seven so Oh man, uh, Vecna so far has been incredible, incredible villain. Obviously, I am still kind of wondering if Vecna will be defeated by the end of season four, or if this villain will actually, which I would love this direction, if it actually spills into the final season. Because one of my biggest things that I always say about Stranger Things on the more negative side of things is that I feel like it's always rinse and repeat. Oh, they fight the monster at the end of the season. They kill it next season, peaceful, and then new monster season after, peaceful, new monster. I mean, it's it's a lot of the same, and I, I hate to say it is repetitive storytelling at the end of the day. Um, you know, there, there is no way around it. it. It absolutely is. But with Vecna, I think there definitely is a very unique concept there, especially because we have gotten the the backstory now on how the upside down was created with eleven and what she did right so not only that and well that and then also the fact that Vecna is the first um you know test subject if you will at the lab and eleven is eleven right so I would find it pretty crazy if you know Vecna just got killed in episode like eight or nine or something you know something just really quick like that. I would personally rather if this was our final villain of the series. I actually would love that. Because not only that, I feel like, do we really want to re rinse and repeat again? Can they really create a better villain than Vecna? Something that's more interesting than how the Upside Down was created? You know what I mean? This feels like final season material already to me. And that's why I feel like they need to keep Vecna around. But again, that's just my opinion. Now, as for Nancy, obviously she is locked into the Upside Down now. And, um, you know, with Vecna and stuff and Steve is trying to kind of snap her out of it and stuff like that. And, you know, obviously the big question is, will they kill Nancy by episode eight when we return? Now, I don't think so. I think it's still a fake out. I think they're trying to kind of get us to, to think so, but if it's not Nancy and I, like I said, I feel like it's a bit obvious. That's why I'm saying, I don't think Nancy will die quite yet. If she will, I think it'll be final season. I just don't see that character going quite yet. But again, you never know. But personally for me, at least in terms of Vecna's like next, you know, victim, someone that they could be taking out. I mean, honestly, you're going to call me crazy. I think that one of these core kids is going to go at some point. Now, I don't think Max, because I feel like they've kind of made that one too obvious. Uh, I just don't think they're going to, you know, go that route exactly. I wouldn't be at all surprised, guys, honestly, if in the final season, uh, they actually pull the plug and they actually do kill off Eleven. Because I actually could see them doing a situation where Eleven is, her death is how the show ends. It's actually a bittersweet end. Because, and it would also kind of call back to season one, except this time it actually happens. Because, here's the thing, you can have Elle survive, and everything that character's gone through, I mean... Honestly, I would love to see that. But at the same time, I see the way they do this show and I'm like, I feel like they're setting up Eleven to be almost like when they finally defeat the Upside Down, which I think will be in the final season, L will be 
dying with it or something you know like that's why it leaves them is because and forever like for good is because l actually sacrifices herself and that's you know how it you know it ends up right i could definitely see something like that and i think that would be pretty insane honestly if they killed l in the final season but i think they will i think that that is gonna happen but in terms of vecna's like next victim like i said I'm thinking it's either going to be Nancy, and maybe I'm wrong here, or they could pull the plug and do Steve. I hope not, but Steve is another one that I'm kind of keeping my eye on right now, just because I can't say he's 100% safe. I still kind of fear that they could be killing off Steve at some point. Right now, I'm more so paying attention to Steve and Nancy, because I feel like those are the two characters they keep focusing on a lot, and I feel like it could be one or the other. Not both, but I feel like one or the other will get um, taken or killed by Vecna. I do. So, that's where I stand on it. Definitely let me know in the comment section below what do you guys think about this. Who do you think will be Vecna's next villain? I'm either saying Steve or potentially Nancy. Um, probably in another way that's not related to the cliffhanger, but it still could be Nancy or uh, Steve. So, definitely let me know in the comment section below what you guys think about it. And... Um, any discussion topics you want me to do on Stranger Things, let me know in the comments. we got a few more weeks before the new season begins, so definitely write down some uh, discussion topics and maybe some Q&A questions as well, too. If I get enough Q&A questions from you guys, I'll do a uh, Stranger Things q and I think that'd be a lot of fun. So anyway, thank you all so much for watching this video, and I'll see you guys really soon for another video. Peace out. <laughs>